Greetings Pisces. Welcome your horoscope. Uh, Gemini time. It rules your uh, fourth house. And that's family, parents. So, like, especially your mother and the women in your house with, you know, Venus can join the moon and the sun with this new moon. It's like there's this whole honoring your parents, honoring your older sister, honoring family, honoring older relatives, acknowledging your heritage and what those people went through to get to where you are today, to have what you have. That's what this is about. And it's also about, you know, sprucing up your house, making it look nicer, bringing in a sense of joy, a spirit of celebration and beauty that you can take into your tribe and you can take into your environment and you can bring that on to other people and you get better memories. You know, you're building an emotional network that feels safe for you so that you can finally take that next step next month when we get to the new moon and you can celebrate all your creative soul all your children all your projects for all they're worth so uh love continues to flow for you pisces with jupiter in your seventh house and even with rahu there um and for suddenly i think you're even luckier in love with mars moving into that ninth house some things are worth investigation love is always worth investigating and even though you're subject to illusion is that a mirage or not you're in it for the healing. Humbly know, go forward knowing, yeah, you can make a mistake, but the only person that never made a mistake is the person that never did anything. This is Cosmic Kev with the Cosmic Forecast. We're going to do this again next week. Thanks for joining me.